Jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. So, hey guys, first of all, you like the new do? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's new, it's awesome, it's great. Okay, so right now I am doing this one handheld style and two about to share with you a few of my favorite holiday movies um, because Merry Christmas it is Christmas and this is my gift to you here on the media channel so let's get started with this shall we um, so my, one of my favorite holiday movies um, happens to be Prep and Landing and also Prep and Landing Naughty and Nice. Now those are two very awesome holiday movies. Um, I watch those with Bunny every single year since they first came out. They are pretty, pretty good movies. And they are about the elves that get the houses ready for Santa when he makes the big run on Christmas Eve to go all around the world to deliver presents to kids. So they go around ahead of Santa and get little runways made, clear up little things to trip them up, make sure everybody is asleep, and everything is prim, proper, and ready for the big guy to come. And Proper Landing, Naughty and Nice is basically the same thing, except this kid wants to get on the nice list after she's been a little bit naughty in dealing with her little brother. Um, so those movies are pretty awesome. Um, the next movie that I love to watch at Christmas time is Polar Express. Tom Hanks stars in many roles in this movie about a kid who doesn't believe in Christmas but then he gets on this train that comes around on Christmas Eve and he goes to visit Santa's village. That movie was pretty, pretty awesome. You guys need to go check it out. Um, another set of movies that we love to watch here at Christmas time is the Santa Claus trilogy. Um, it began in 1994 and it stars Tim Allen as this guy named Scott Kelvin who accidentally kills Santa. Puts on the suit and from the Santa Claus until Santa Claus 3, the escape clause, and even thereafter, he is the big guy in red. He is Santa Claus. He in the second movie, he has to get married. In the third movie, there's his escape clause, and Jack Frost is a bad guy. And it's just a really, really awesome movie. Um, another movie that I love to watch this time of year is Scrooged. It stars Bill Murray, and it's a version of A Christmas Carol. Basically, he is the youngest TV executive, and he has the job of putting on a Christmas carol on network television but kind of on the sidelines he is starring in his own little Christmas carol it's, it's a freaking hilarious movie it's pretty awesome um over darn it um another movie at this time of year that I absolutely love 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 to watch is a Christmas story I'm actually kind of upset this year my mother did not keep our satellite subscription because I'm missing 24 hours of a Christmas story on TBS that movie is freaking awesome god I love Christmas story it's a 1983 movie it came out the year before I was born mind you um about this kid who lives in the 1950s who wants a red rider BB gun and every adult keeps telling him you should try out kid and the whole movie is funny on how to get this BB gun it's pretty awesome and it takes you through the um 
the traditions his family does every year at Christmas in the small town of Indiana. It's, it's, it's actually pretty dope. Um, another Christmas movie that I absolutely love to watch is Christmas with the Cranks. It is another Tim Allen Christmas movie where he stars as this guy who uh, he and his wife, played by Jamie Lee Curtis, are celebrating their first Christmas without their daughter. He gets this bright idea to go on a vacation and quote, skip Christmas. Who skips Christmas? This guy is pretty hilarious. Is based off of a book. Um, I do not remember the name of the book, but it's it's a funny movie. It's pretty awesome. I saw it at theaters, and I almost died laughing. And I watch it every year now. It's pretty funny. Um, another movie that I love to watch this time of year is. How the Grinch Stole Christmas and I like the Jim Carrey version but I also like the classic Dr. Seuss cartoon version both of them are pretty awesome and I'm sorry you could not go without watching that movie and singing you're a mean one Mr. Grinch it's awesome awesome and if you've never seen how the Grinch Stole Christmas, who are you? Who are you? Who are you? That movie is freaking awesome. It's amazing. Both the Jim Carrey version and the animated version. A, another movie that I absolutely love to watch this time of year is Home Alone. Home Alone is a pretty awesome movie. It uh, stars a young Macaulay Culkin, the actual Macaulay Culkin movie that made him Macaulay Culkin. Um, he stars as this kid named Kevin McAllister whose parents book a vacation um, with the whole family and there's like a huge huge extended family in this movie and somehow some way they lose Kevin like the entire movie um it's like you can tell that this family is just a just This family is just a big bad, big bag of horrible. There's like a whole bunch of kids. There's like extended family, and they something happens. The power goes out. The clocks are just completely screwed. Everybody wakes up late, and somehow they leave Kevin. Um. Exactly how are you going to lose an entire child? How? How do you lose an entire child? Um a, another Christmas movie I love watching every year is um any version of A Christmas Carol. And the one I'm going to go with right now is the Jim Carrey version. The most recent version made in 2008-2009 using stop motion and Jim Carrey played almost all of the characters in the movie. It was it was nice seeing him do um, kind of a period holiday drama um he actually did very well in the movie and 
I do like the Muppet Christmas Carol version too. I like any version of a Christmas Carol because it reminds you that you can learn from what happened in your past and it's never too late to change. Change is good. Um, another Christmas movie I love to watch that I don't think people that is it it has actually become a big debate on whether or not it's a Christmas movie or it's a Halloween movie it's a nightmare before Christmas that movie God I love that movie I am admittedly obsessed with nightmare before Christmas nightmare before Christmas <coughs> as Excuse me, we all know, or should know, it's a Tim Burton film about this skeleton guy named Jack Skellington. He is the king of Halloween. He lives in the Halloween town. He's bored with his life and he stumbles upon Christmas town. It's a good movie. Um, and last but definitely not least um the 125,000 percent movie that we always 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 have to watch at Christmas time is a Charlie Brown Christmas that is the one movie that we always always have to watch because my mom grew up on a Charlie Brown Christmas. I grew up on a Charlie Brown Christmas. It is a thing. It is a tradition. Charlie Brown forever and always. And that poor Charlie Brown Christmas tree. Such a good movie. Such a good movie. Do you like my Christmas mix? What is your favorite Christmas movie? Comment down below and tell me what your favorite Christmas movie is. And while you're down there, hit that subscribe button and then move over, bing that little bell so you get all the notifications of the videos that I put out. Um, I do reviews of movies, TV shows. I have a great review coming up of the movie Bright After Christmas on, yep, on the Netflix original Bright After Christmas. So stay tuned for that. And please, please, please stick around for skits and sketches and things of that nature. It's going to be awesome. I hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas. I am going to go back to work on the special year-end montage I always do on the vlog channel. I love you guys. I will see you on the vlog channel so you guys can see what I did yesterday on Christmas Eve. Maybe you guys have a wonderful Christmas. And if you're having a white Christmas, I hope you're being safe and you're warm and snuggled up with your families and open lots and lots of gifts. I love you guys. Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays. And I will see you next time. Mwah. Be kind. Be brave. Be awesome. <laughs> doki doki. Now go out and spread the doki doki. Love you, Wonderland. Merry Christmas.